So you guys heard about the um, the guy that lost his left side? Well, he's all right right now. <laughs> hey, Senor Jackson here. And today I'm gonna be showing you a little bit more about the 16 millimeter uh, APS-C lens for the Sony APS-C ca uh, body cameras and everything. And my subject for today will be Moose. Right over here. I got them all customized with this little 360 camera and everything. And of course, our other doggo, Tanuki, in the background. They're all being good right now. So, give me a moment. I'm gonna give them a treat so they can stay still a bit longer. So, using the 16 millimeter, uh, using the 16 millimeter lens with uh, Moose over here. Uh, a brown coat, brownish coat with uh, brown eyes. For the most part, the auto eye focus for animals works pretty well and everything. So, most look over here. Most, no, not, don't look up. So, one of the cool things that I like to do, uh, I always like to put uh, cat sounds to get his attention. Most. Oh, so more. No, he's not even looking at me. He's looking at all the first. Most. So the eye autofocus working well and everything. And also to let you know I'm using a video like the Godox 150UL um, to bring a little bit more light in so I can see his face and all that fun stuff. Um, so here are more shots. Oops. Let me get closer to get his beautiful his beautiful head. Isn't, isn't that right, Moose? Nope, getting a snoot, now his eyes. All right, now more of a full body. Full shots is always going lower. Stay, close. Moose is freaking out. Still not looking down, but no, the, seat, the roof is too interesting. No, no, no. What do you see? Huh. So this is doing his bad statue impression. Um, so this is pretty much just me adjusting some settings here. And since there is no eye out of focus for video use, it just focuses on the face or anything that matters. And as you can see, it works pretty well for doggos, for a brown coat, brown eye uh, doggo. This is always just curious and everything. And of course, I'm gonna be uh, testing out these lens with other other different types of dogs with different eye colors and all that fun stuff and different color coats to see how it works, how the auto focus works, how the quality of the lens and the camera body works. So yeah, that is pretty much it with uh, in regards of this lens. And right now it's around seven o'clock here in Houston, so we got some decent light going on. But of course, with the video light that I got here, um, I just needed something uh, so I can look a bit more fancy and all that fun stuff. Well, now let's go inside, guys. Let's go. All right, guys, now we're, now we're inside with the moose. Uh, we're gonna take some indoor shots to see how the focus is and how the quality of the lens of the 60 millimeter lens is. So let's do it, Moose. Let's get ready. Come on. There you go. You know what I'm Good boy. That's how you do that. Let me take off the collar off of you. There you go. Moose. 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 I don't want him to. It works on most dogs once I do this. Let me get closer. I'll make sure the microphone can hear me. Okay, so I want to see if I could get him to. 
tilt his head here. Hopefully it's not too loud. Beautiful moose. Okay, so there you go. Now I wanna see if I can get a full body. A full body picture of the moose. Alright, different meow. section of that so now I'm gonna see how good the uh, the, the video section will be as you can see that is right in the focus is more on his, his little boot So to 200, and the aperture to f 2.8. Focus on the paper. Focus on the paper. Focus on the moose. Oh, moose. Well, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.